I'm a millennial, but I'm not that. I'm not like those characters. I've also, I've also decided to do something fun with each of the main like enemy factions I take down. I'm gonna replace one of my limbs with an artificial limb. So by the end of it, I go full Darth Vader because it's like I've given up something in pursuit of power. Right. It's like, wait, boss, what happened to your arm? Uh, yeah, remember that little encounter, that last encounter we have with the Lost Panteros? Yeah. My arm got really fucked up and I, it couldn't be saved, so they had to, uh, oh. Uh, they fixed it! That. They fixed it! Yes! Okay. We're back in the game, boys. You got Yes, the the we rolled it back. It worked. Okay, cool. It's buggy, but... Oh, yeah. Fucking... Oh, thank God. All right. Also, in terms of, like, uh, downloading the newer wrestlers, I've made it's like... You know how I made room for the stuff I'm making? Yeah. I went through I went through my list and, like, what wrestlers don't I use or which ones have not been used in a long time? And I just deleted them. Fair enough. Yeah, it would it would actually do you some good to do a purge. I'm back, gentlemen. Oh, I'm so relieved. Oh God, I can't. He's even not try. relieved that you're back. He's relieved that he fixed the thing. Yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, he... go go back to poopy butthole town. Go back to poopy butthole town. I, I, I figured it wasn't for me. <laughs> No, no, here, here, here. I'll, I'll give you a virtual hug, okay? Here you go. Hug. There you go. There you go. Uh, <laughs> but basically, the the game broke during the stream towards the end. I, I think I told you it that. Was, the tag team accident, I accidentally deleted the tag team from the wrong spot. And, it and, then said, Rusty, and then Rusty says, like, oh, you gotta do it from the actual game. And Ari's like, ah! Yeah. So what I did was, I basically did a Windows 10 style, like, roll it back, system restore point, it fixed it, so, like, it's a little buggy, like, Kofi Kingston appears to have vanished into thin air, but at least it's there. So, I'm not gonna question it, I'm gonna keep it as is. Yeah. And... Considering that the latest, considering that the last system restore point was before the recording, so it should be everything in order. Everything should be back into place. In short, Ventura's losses now do not count. Well, no. Uh, I mean, his wins don't count. Now, nah, well, because we'll, you have reset the timeline. Well, no. Nah. You 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 pull you pull the Infinity Gauntlet out of storage. If you'll excuse me, I'm gonna type that to Rusty. <laughs> Tell Rusty that. Did the snap reorganize timeline? M God now. Hashtag blessed. <laughs> I reset the timeline in doing so. <laughs> So, Vince <laughs> wins, don't count. We rolled back the timeline, back the timeline. <laughs> you know everyone's gonna call shenanigans on that. Yeah, 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 Rusty's not falling for that bullshit. I'm like, fine. <laughs> He's like, no, no, that's not how it works. You gotta take the L's, man. Uh, you can take the W's, but you also have to take the L's with them. Uh, <laughs> it's 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 bad, I know, but you know how many L's I've taken in this game, and I just let it go because it was fun. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, just to kind of bring it back up to speed. I'm gonna see if I can recreate. Let me let Rusty know. Uh, so he made a Google spreadsheet of the universe mode. Well, as we were doing it, so. Yeah. 
So at least we have the stuff stored, the info stored, so we don't have to call the boys up. All right. Yeah, it it did it uh it also deleted the uh, universe mode, so I gotta get that sorted out. Okay. So universe tutorials. Nope. Don't need that. What is with this game and throw me into worlds where there's no one? There's no one. Oh, stop shooting my tow truck. I'm just here doing my job. I'm repoing your shit. World Championship must be chosen. I'm gonna make like a bullshit show just to fucking delete SmackDown and get everything back in order. So I'll call this one the shit show. Uh... I'm a Brit. I'm a black Brit. Actually, Union Jack fills that role, doesn't he? He's a black Brit. Yes. Now, Zach, for your services, if you can end this... Here's a sandwich. If you can end this vendors, I'll give you a championship opportunity at next week's stream... Hey, should uh, hey, you should give him a, a title all his own, the Fox, the Foxy Grandpa title. <laughs> it's just a title with a picture of Nick Wilde, <laughs> the Zootopia. Ch it's just like get one of those like the Wild, the Wild Child Championship. The wild you want that, Zach? You want the Wild? Ch what is with? What is wrong? Oh, with it even this? reset some of the belts. Well, then again, I did notice that during the stream, too, like, Amanda Walker doesn't have the, the Raw Women's Championship anymore. It did, yeah, like, I'm a... actually surprised she won that. Oh, uh, yeah, it who reset did she fight it. for it, by the way? Uh... I think it was, like, a multi-women championship. I don't remember who she beat specifically. Because I remember Rhea Ripley was the Raw Women's Champion, or was that, uh... Or is that a what's her name the the Irish one, uh, the the one who's called the boss? Oh, Becky Lynch, yeah, also known as the last kicker. You need at least have one major. That is the major show. Oh, I guess I gotta put let's put random people in it. Don't do 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 there. There, there's twelve people now. Delete SmackDown. There we go. Okay. Alright, so NGW was Mondays. That's seven matches. Really? I'm gonna play that. What? <laughs> That's the one. The way of the platypus. The way of the platypus. <laughs> I was watching some Phineas and Ferb episodes earlier today. That's that's uh, Dr. Starline in a nutshell, the way of the platypus. <laughs> Alright, the Miz. The Eggman Simp. Gloria Jones. Ah, yes, I'm back to the war. Uh, oh yeah, did you hear about where the uh, where the new Assassin's Creed is going to take place? The eight, ninth century uh, ba Baghdad. And Baghdad. Japan. Mm. Fi Japan. Fucking finally, it looks like an Assassin's Creed game. China. Yeah, everyone's like, why the fuck did it take so long? <laughs> From the looks of it, you... it's we're gonna get Japan, we're gonna get Fuel Japan, Baghdad, and I think we're getting the Salem of an assassin during the Salem witch trials. Oh, I know, that'll be I interesting. Know you like, I know you like Valhalla, it looks cool, but it didn't it did not feel like an Assassin's Creed game to me. I know, I know. Hey, crew, if, if you're missing the hood, then how do you know it's an Assassin's Creed game? But Assassin's Creed doesn't take place in the hood. Uh, I would love that. That is a game I would I've play. Always, I've always... Assassin's you know, Creed in the like, hood, motherfuckers! You, you know what? I've always <clears throat> pictured, like, the Assassins in the future, they'd probably be, you know, the ones working with, you know, people in the hood, you know? Criminal Underworld. Really? I thought that'd be the Templars or something. No, I mean like... No, I mean like, you know, Templar... 
Like say legal, like say selling drugs, you know. I could picture I could picture the the assassins working with the urban people, and the cops would be working with the Templars. Yeah, because I've already, you know, I've, I have always thought about it though. Like, what? How can you force the cops to use melee weapons though? Because that's kind of a big drawback. Is Nightsticks. Yeah, like they're nightsticks, like because they're very, because they're not gonna use. Because you know that a lot of cops would probably switch to their uh, firearms, and I'm like, well, maybe the assassin could throw some, could throw something down, and it disables all the firearms in that room, except for his own, of course. Where the hood? Where the hood? Where the hood at? La 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 la. When you come back. This is such it's like a, a good word. work. Come on, you know you want Assassin's Creed in the hood, though. I want an Assassin's Creed set during the Civil War, to be honest. Didn't we hear you? Oh, I know we didn't. My mistake. Right, Technically, Jones. the closest you'll get to that is the American Revolution. And not gonna lie, it's grown on me. Like, I know a lot of people like to shit talk Assassin's Creed 3, but not gonna lie, the more I look at it, the more. I start to enjoy it, you know? Thank you. Finally someone else gets it. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, I I love that game, but my friends were like, no, it was boring, it was stupid, I hated the main character because he was a blah blah blah, and I'm just like, fuck you, Colin like, was awesome. You know, I, it's, I think it's partially because I played the remaster and you start, and I started to understand what kind of character they were going for with, uh, someone like Connor, you know, like how, he can't be an Ezio no matter how you look at it he is not an Ezio and that's what makes him unique if he were yes. to be he faced a lot more tragedy than Ezio could ever hoped to so face. a half-breed, also a half-breed like him in that time period pretty taboo it's like a guy like him, like he'd be lucky like, he dealt with a lot of trauma, and, like, probably way more than what Ezio had to deal with. Oh yeah, sure, your whole family was slaughtered in the square, but... But uh, Connor, he lost his entire- he lost his entire village at four years old. Alright, so... And he had to watch his surrogate, and he had to watch his mother burn in front of him. And not to mention he was for- he ended up having no choice- well, he ended up killing his father. Granted, granted, Haytham did say to do it, didn't he? I think everyone has widely accepted that Haytham just let Connor kill him. Yeah, because everyone knows that Haytham could have easily fought him off, but he's like, no. If no, I'm being this honest, has been a long time coming. Do what you gotta do. I al I've always thought about that scene. Like, All right, um, if I may interject real quick. Um, yeah. so I need to make the tag team for Miranda and Tina Armstrong. I set the team announcer to the Queens, but what would be a good name for Miranda and Tina from Dead or Alive? Hmm. We got Miranda, who's pretty much like a sex fiend. <laughs> and Tina Armstrong. And Tina, who's, who's a beast. Yeah. Um... The sexual predator stop just kidding. Um uh, no. What? No. What? No. <laughs> what? what? I need to make okay. up a tag the rule that we have that we established for the universe mode is that it has to be the champions uh from the randomizer. With certain of exceptions, of course. We did a little bit of trading, but so I gotta think. But like Cryptic has a women's tag team championship, so I gotta come up with, like, uh, a name. Um, hmm. Unless you have an idea. We could probably make the one that I made for Miranda and Gloria Jones, like the Pussycat Dolls or something like that. Or... The Badass. The Badasses. The Bad Lasses. There you go. Yeah, all right, the bad lasses. All right, and there's our team. Okay, cheer. 
Uh, I don't care what it is, that guy's ruining a good game of football. Good game of football. Uh, it doesn't matter what, like, what finisher entrance they have, right? Like, no. Nope. Yeah, we'll it's just all good. We'll let it play out, and then, like, for the streams or whatever, you know, we'll just go from there. We'll just make it up as we go along. Uh. What's new, pussycat? Oh, God! What's new, pussycat? <laughs> Aided splash. This has no re This looks so fucking... <laughs> Aided crossbody. It's literally just Miranda being thrown on top of somebody. <laughs> oh, hello. Kinky. Alright. <clears throat> now we're talking. Hey, what? Gave him the finisher. Don't, don't tell me the game's bugged again. What the fuck? Yeah. With our luck, it probably is. Yeah, 2K22 is. It's starting to show its wear and tear. Everyone's just waiting for the newer uh... AEW game. I wonder how that's going to turn out. I don't know. The play style's kind of got me a little. Mm. You got CM Punk suspended. Kenny Omega. No, no, I don't suspended. care about that. Oh. Uh, I don't care about that. What I care about is that the way it plays kind of has me going. Mm. Like you got to build up like a meter to use your moves. It's like, why can't we just make a? Oh, they weren't kidding. You really can not choose a tag team venture in universe mode. I was I read that up on the the Reddit's like for two K twenty two games and all that you can't for some reason you can't give your tag teams a finisher. Alright. Weird. Yeah. Odd thing for them to program, but we'll just let it go. Shenanigans? Yeah. Alright. Us, I'll make a fortune. And then Xavier Woods and Max Thunder. So I gotta remove the new day only from the universe mode, not the other mode. But we're the new day. Not anymore. <laughs> it's a brand new day. We split them up. <laughs> I gave up. That's it. What game are you playing, Zach? Battlefield? Battlefield 1, yeah. I'm currently play. We're going to Austria Hungary and Italy. Hmm, okay. You going to Hungary? You going to Hungary? Hungary, yeah. Are you hungry? Am I Italian or am I Austria Hungarian? It's Italian, 10 out of 10. Hmm. Italian. Ah! <sighs> Oh, I'm Hus Austro Hungarian. I'll just give him the. Exterminate the, apol the, pr the proletariat. Where's the one I gave? Mike Systems Check. I'm Chris. I'm Chris. Exterminate the proletariat. Exterminate the proletariat. If you don't, if you're blue and you don't know where to go to, why don't you go where fashion sits? Put on the Ritz! <laughs> Excellent. Device off. All right. Fire and desire. That's the Fire. name of their entrance. Fire and desire. That would make a good oh, name for Miranda and Tina Armstrong. Oh, that's perfect. Okay. I can picture Miranda trying to put the moves on Luke Fox, and Luke Fox fully reciprocates them, even though she's expecting him not to. And it's just like, hey, <laughs> baby. <laughs> hey, baby. You want to, like, do it? Like, right what here? What the hell was that? 
You tell I was pull pulling the trigger and you're telling me I did not pull the trigger at all? Really? Did your gun die out or something? He pulled the trigger, but he did not pull the trigger. Or did he? Perhaps. Oh, that Wait, I didn't hear that, uh... Man, like your Hocus register. Pocus is getting a second movie. Oh, yeah. yeah. I saw the trailer. That'll be kind of fun. I'm actually, I'm actually looking forward to this. Because that I, mean, I grew up with that movie. That, yeah, the first one was really mm -hmm. funny. I remember that. I also, I remember like one of the scenes where they're driving down the road in the pickup truck towards the cemetery because of hollow ground, and then uh, I think it was like uh, Ben Midler's character Winifred flies up on her broom beside the thing with her pillowing cloak and goes, "Hold on, let me see your license and registration." <laughs> Tries to ram her off the road. <laughs> the zombie. Ben! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's a fun movie. We're gonna watch that for Halloween. Oh, totally. Well, cut. Billy cuts open his mouth so he can talk. Wench! <laughs> I've waited a hundred years to say that. Because <laughs> st his mouth was stitched shut, so he gets to finally call her a wench. Alright. Just wench. The bad lasses have been created now to split the new day. They are no longer here. Alright, now Xavier. I just realized, you should, Xavier I just realized you should totally make uh you should totally make the dudes with attitude. I mean you have the, the thing, don't you? Yeah, I can download them or no, I can download like the like the logo and stuff and like recreate them. Yep. Crusher and Ari. And Edge, if you want to make it a Trinity. That would be kind of cool. Actually, you know what? Uh, do you want me to add him to NJW? Because everyone else has like a full list of characters. Do you want to add him? Who, Edge? Yeah, do you, I don't think anybody's claimed Edge yet, as far as I know. Let me see. Well, well what do we have so far for... Um... Okay, so... Uh... Okay, so JR wants Alexa Bliss, Dominic Dojovic, Shotzi, Raquel, Beth Phoenix, and Sally Acorn. Okay, so okay, nobody's claimed. Uh, so I I can join your team, and then nobody's said Edge yet, as far as I know. Oh, no one wants to go on this day. <laughs> Where's Max Thunder? There he is. All right, so Max Thunder's from Streets of Rage. Uh, we'll call them <laughs> the Bullies. No, no, that's not the Brood, the Country Dominates, the Crew, Doom Brigade, the the Dudes with the Eliminators, Empire, <laughs> Dudes with Attitude, Entourage, Evolution. The Fabulous Freebirds, The Fabulous Truth, The Faces of Fear, The Fall, The FPI, Phenomenal Flare, Four Horsemen, Gate Crashers, The Geeks. I misheard that. I misheard that. It's not like you said Gate Crashers. I'm like, wait, what? Yes, The Gate <laughs> Crashers. <laughs> uh, Darn beautiful men always, always taking my champion belts. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna call them high voltage. Do it. High voltage. There we go. Xavier hey, Woods is a cool. Um, Xavier Woods, who runs the channel Up Up Down Down on YouTube, he's a wrestler, but he also runs like a gaming channel for WWE. Really? Yeah. I was actually at some point gonna download if somebody made him or if he's uploaded it. He's doing a My Rise uh, uh -huh. series with a character he created called Zero with an X, which is kind of cool. Hey, That's maybe neat. maybe he'll notice us. Notice me, senpai. I right, don't uh, no. I think Xavier Woods has uh, more important things to do than to see My Rise playthroughs. <laughs> no, I meant like. Uh, that's what he's doing on YouTube. I meant like maybe he'll notice our universe mode shenanigans. Oh, maybe. Who knows? Let's see. She's like, oh, shit, you team me with Max Thunder? It's awesome. 
Yeah. Streets of Rage. That's a good series. That game has like some kick-ass music. And meanwhile, there's Gisu. Gisu. I am driving an ice cream truck so that I may sell drugs. I'm Yippee. not making this up. Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! This does the sound like we make when we're driving that shit. Oh god, Max Thunder is fucking giant compared to. Uh, let's oh see. my god. Oh my god. You know what the horn. You know what the siren is? What? The ice, the ice cream jingle. Oh god. <laughs> do 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 do. Uh, I forgot. The ice cream trucks that used to pass by my town always had like fucking classical music. Like the entertainer, Scott Joplin. I always, I always remember, uh, like I've been watching uh, the, the Cuphead show this new season, and there was one episode where an ice cream man was driving Mugman insane, and he actually loses his shit at the end of the episode when he spoils the ending to a book he's been trying to read the whole time. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh hey, I have that book. Mugbeard dies at the end. Stare at him. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one! He dies! Tackles him to the floor. <laughs> like he just completely loses it. Hey, I know that. Hey, I know that match. Oh, loses the belt at the end of Venduza. <laughs> That's a good one! Ari loses! <laughs> just shows Ari just. It shows Ari just punching the guy. Take it back! <laughs> Wait, does Max Thunder have a theme song? Max Thunder theme. I'm curious. Max Bloody Chunder. Hmm. Max Thunder. Street Wait a minute, where the hell did that saint go? Follow the sound of the fuck. Follow the sound of the ice cream jingle. <laughs> Okay, yeah, uh, Max Thunder doesn't have his own theme, so I'll just put, like, stage music. There you go. High voltage. Yeah, but you were right. expecting me to have... But you were expecting me to upgrade my guns, were you, bastards? Kill a gallon gunner. Oh, that's easy. Okay, I'll listen to the music. Do they have, like, techno... Is he actually playing it during in the middle of the game? Yep. Oh, well, we can't give him too much crap. I used to do that shit with the Friday the 13th game. Remember that? Careless Whisper Jason. <laughs> it's like, where's Cryptic? <laughs> oh god, no. <laughs> Again, I fucking dare you. I dare you, I double dare you. I dare you to go fucking heal that guy. God, I remember when we played uh, Battlefield and we actually had fun erecting the uh, the bunkers. Mm. God, remember, <laughs> remember that remember that one match when I actually <laughs> when I when we actually won because we were on the last checkpoint but everyone was off fighting and then you guys came back and you saw everything was assembled mm -hmm. you're just like what just like cryptic what did you how did you do this i'm like you have a hammer that can make this stuff <laughs> it's hammer why time did no one tell me? <laughs> just why did no one tell me we had a hammer <laughs> <laughs> 
And it's just like, alright, Cryptic, we're gonna start the match now. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go build stuff. <laughs> <laughs> just no hesitation. I'm gonna go build stuff. I'm trying to find like, a good techno. It's so hard to hear over the crowd. Had him look now. What about it? All oh, the Americans took it in the game. I mean, well, no, let's we'll just go. Look out! The German furries are coming. What makes you say that? They're wearing the gimp gear. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh God! Titantron movie. Awful. What's he playing? I'm curious. Some rap game. Ew. Why not just mute him? That's an option. Don't worry, Zach. I got you covered. Play a bunch of fart sounds. Get his attention. That better? Uh, give me a moment. I got bayoneted while you guys were trying to do that. Hmm. Sonny the Vill, Smackdown, Shots. Shawn Michaels, Shawn Rick, Rick Boog's work? Twenty years of battlefield, Jesus. Has it really been around for twenty years? Yep. Yeah. Oh god, I feel old. The twentieth anniversary. Oh, I remember when I first started playing this during Battlefield One. That's what got me for the game. Yeah, that's kind of yeah, same to be honest. I prefer this was my first Battlefield game. I was not really a Battlefield player. Mm. I'd have to say Battlefield Bad Company, because my God, was were those guys funny? Yeah, mm -hmm. I heard that. That was pretty good. Demonic Fox. What a nice name. I love how I love the joke that when the queen died, that that one influencer gave birth to which to a baby. It's like no, I didn't yeah. give birth to the reincarnation of Queen Elizabeth. <laughs> she respawned. <laughs> yeah, she respawned. You hear the TF2 <laughs> click sound. <laughs> no, she drank from the chalice. Okay, Queen, so I got a mission fall. for you. Saddle up. <laughs> God. Oh God. Somebody's gonna do that in like an SFM form. Queen respawn at the hub base. Now she has to. Uh... What mates doing on the ship? What in what the, the hell are y'all doing? Oh. Holy shit, we have one of those. You're up against these people who are just so desperate to win. It's one of those teams who, like, they've been winning the whole time, but now they're losing, and so they are going out of their way to make sure that uh, we that they win. That includes. By any means necessary. 
Yep. Grenade oh, spamming, fuck. dude. You know a team is a sore are sore you know teams are sore losers when they start using grenades. Hmm. Yeah. They're getting <laughs> desperate. When they yeah, they're so fucking desperate. That that they will go out of their way to try and win, you know? Yeah. I've actually, it's more common, honestly, in Call of Duty, actually. Is that a tornado? Oh, it is. It's coming right towards them. They're gonna die. They're coming right yeah. towards us! Like, I've never, like, in Call of Duty, I actually had a team who was trash-talking, and then when they started losing, they didn't even stick around for the end of the match. They fucking left. Damn. Like the little bitches they are. Like how pathetic. There we go. Like how pathetic do you have to be that you get that you leave a team, you know, just because you're not winning, you know? Yeah, it's dumb. Like. Like I'm sorry to say, but that is a that is, it's it's an incredibly pathetic move in my honest opinion. If they have places oh, wait. to go, then... oh god. There we go. All right. All right. Uh, get that. All right. So PW, not PWF. Uh, NJW is. Done. Well, for the time being, because I don't think we got everybody yet, didn't we? I'm about to mm. I'm about to click uh, Rusty's ex uh, Excel spreadsheet and then add everybody else. Oh god! So now I gotta do PWF. Right, I'm gonna do PWF. So wait a minute. Oh yeah, I imagine we're gonna do our NGW uh, drafts later. Well, all of it. Uh, yeah. Let's see, tomorrow... How do I have the most... How well, am today... I the top player? Guys, this doesn't make sense. Look, I had 14 kills and 10 deaths, but the two players below me, who are in second and third place, they both had 20 kills and only died five and seven times. Maybe, maybe they, uh... Maybe because they were put in second and third place, they had a shitty attitude. I don't... Okay. <laughs> You would consider that? Hmm? The fuck I forgot the wall. How do you... Okay, how do you mute these guys? It's... I think you have to go on the squad formation thing and then select them and then mute them. There's like... Like once you select them, of course. Alright, this thing doesn't go fully automatic on the f every time I What game play. are you playing, Fortnite? 2042. Oh. Yeah. Oh You're shit, right thank god for two faster. slugs, and I died anyway. Enjoy your master, master. Master of Puppets and Pulling Strings. That's a good song. Yeah. <laughs> Metallica. Oh, yeah. The thing was Neon One. Master! 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 The fact that, the fact that the Eddie and Stranger Things fucking killed that shit was awesome. Mm-hmm. It was badass. Here are your winners! Uh, victory music neon. Stop Master. shooting me, you monkeys! So that's that. Alright, and then we'll just hold 